Mercy Land. Arena of Solution and Power. My name is Sunday Naman. I'm from Enugu State. But I'm living in Togo. We come to share our testimony. If you watch the board there, you will see what the Lord has done for me. The first testimony I want to share is for the trailer that you see inside the board there. It's because of uh, last year, October, surrounding water. Uh, when the surrounding water is coming, I see, I think, say, if we come for the program, but I fight my possible miss, no way. Then I call my senior brother from Enugu that uh, I want him to come and assist the program. Then my brother go back to the village and bring the water to come. The night of that day when you reach for village, the dream we are a dream is the problem with a woman. Oh. So the woman say we, we cannot take the water from, from there to here. Then after in the morning, I call my brother, whether I hear you see the thing where he see me saying as the same dream he dream oh. I say okay. Then I send him money to come here as I can't feel calm. My brother come here. He never reached one week where the program finish. My brother go back. One festival day, they say it's a free day, no school. Then if you say that it's a school, I follow, take my children to school, then I come for shop in time. Then they say there's no school that day, it's a free day. I stay for house. After it, my phone ring. One of my brother called me for near our shop. Then he said, where are you there? I tell him, I never come out. I won't come out be that. Somebody defy me, say no. He said, that God I worship, make I continue worshiping it too. If I reach for my shop now, I will not know it again. I say, what is happening? He said, two trailer for himself in some inside my shop. I say, nobody die. So the whole trailer spoiled. I call my wife, say, let us go see. We reach there, we see, it's exactly what the man called me and told me is happening. I look for it, I say, hmm. I call one man where they do picture. May he come snap the picture for me. I won't take and do testimony. So, another one is, there is a, God bless us with a, a house. But we, October last year, I bought a car. If you are clapping for this great God, you can do better than that now. Put those hands together for Jesus. What word of advice would you have to give to these persons that are listening to you this morning? My advice for viewers is, please, if you see something that I hold for my hand, it's just like a SIM card. If you get this SIM card, network is always in your phone. <laughs> so. <laughs> God blessed him with a large acres of land. Acres of land! Voilà, certes, les spectateurs, nous te remercions pour, nous bénissons l'éternel pour la vie de cet homme qui, que l'éternel avait béni. Il disait qu'au dé, départ, l'homme de Dieu avait annoncé le programme des eaux environnantes. Et il a envoyé le message à son frère au village et ils ont apporté l'eau environnante, l'eau de leur village. Et ils sont venus assister au programme ici. Après le programme, l'éternel Dieu du prophète Jérémie leur avait donné une protection divine. Il y avait des camions d'envoyés à l'écran qui ont failli de, euh, détruire son, sa boutique. Mais l'éternel Dieu du prophète Jérémie l'avait épargné. Il a l'accident, n'avait rien cassé de la maison. Mais toute la famille a été bien préservée et la boutique également. Non seulement ça, le Dieu de Prophète Jérémie l'avait donné encore une percée financière. Il a pu euh, accomplir la, la, la maison qu'il bâtissait et il a acheté aussi une voiture et de, au moins neuf parcelles de terrain. Et c'est pourquoi il est ici à nouveau pour dire merci au Dieu de Prophète Jérémie. Applaudissons pour le Seigneur. Our brother, we celebrate with you, we rejoice with you for what this great God of Sino Prophet Jeremiah Mutafi has done in your life. We would all to advise you that you should continue making the word of God a standard for your life. By so doing more and more testimony, we'll continue to locate you and every member of your family. And also we want to advise you that you should continually be a consistent partner to Mercy Television. By so doing testimony will not leave your household we rejoice with you and we pray that your testimony will remain permanent in your life in the name of our lord jesus amen somebody put those hands together thank for jesus. jesus thank you
Bring up solution in Paul. My name is Samson Florence. I'm from Bayasa State. The problem that brought me to Mercy Land is the problem of hepatitis B and C. I've been suffering from this problem for a long time, not knowing that the, it was hepatitis B positive. So this uh, past week uh, program, the surrounding water, on the 19th of that day, which is the program, I went to do the test and they said hepatitis B positive and C, hepatitis C is what negative. So I took the results. I came to the program. I prayed with the results. I said, God, I'm not living here the same way I came with these results. During that program, on Saturday, which is the mountain program, the mountain, as in the sound from the mountain, I need it for three days. I used it to bed the first day, the second day, the third day, which is the Sunday night. When I was sleeping, Papa came and said, Take your report. This is your new report. When I woke up that day. And somebody you are just sitting down like that. Can you stand on your feet and give Jesus a big shout of prayer? Somebody put those hands together for Jesus Christ. Our dear sister, we want to ask you for how long did you suffer from this demonic illness? I was suffering from this thing for the past eight years. I want to ask you, how did this uh, demonic infirmity affect your life? In fact, it affected me in my academic life and every otherwise. Because of this illness, I cannot stand for long. If I stand for long, my eye will tell me, I will tell them I want to sit down. Every five minutes, I will be throwing up because of this illness. But after the use of the sun, I did not feel those symptoms again. Somebody put those hands together for Jesus Christ. We are seeing a picture on the screen of our television. Can you throw more light? The picture you are seeing, that is the color of the urine I was urine that time. If I went to toilet, that is the color of the urine. And this is the present. This is the present urine now. This is the present urine now, looking healthy. Somebody, can you put those hands together for Jesus Christ? I yeah, would want you to throw more light on those medical reports, those medical documents we are seeing on the board. The first one is the one that the doctor said uh, the hepatitis B is positive. Then the hepatitis C is negative. Then yesterday when I went to confirm, the two are negative there. Somebody, can you celebrate Jesus? I want to ask you, what is your advice to viewers all over the world watching you right now? And before that, how are you feeling now? I'm so, so happy. Because if I were to spend money, I can't even count. But God just did it for me. With just a son. People say just a son. But I know what God did for me. Somebody can put his hands together for Jesus Christ. You can see the tears of joy. My advice to viewers all over the world that are watching me, there is a grace in this place. If you have not discovered it, that is left for you. The God in this place is really working. If you are going through the same challenge I'm going through, just come and believe. Follow the instruction and that is all. There is no why Cela, et elle est retournée en conseil des docteurs pour faire des examens. Et elle était maintenant euh, euh, diagnostiquée avec peau négative. Et aujourd'hui, elle est pleinement en, en bonne santé. Elle retourne maintenant euh, à l'école comme la fois, comme l'habitude. Et c'est pourquoi elle est venue encore à nouveau pour remercier le Dieu de professeur Jérémy pour cette guérison totale. Applaudissements pour le Seigneur. 
Somebody, if you are clapping for Jesus, you can do better than that. Rejoice with you. We celebrate with you. And we we'll advise you to bring the word of the Lord a standard in your life. That by so doing, affliction will never rise the second time in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Thank you, Somebody Jesus. Somebody put those hands together for Jesus Christ. Arena Solution and Power. Yes, really. My name is Engineer Simon Nuhu from Kaduna, working in Kano. Yes, the person beside me is my prophetess, Prophetess Susan Thomas from Kaduna. My testimony goes like this I am working with an airline in Kano, and my aircraft engineer working with Max Air in Kano. As a workshop manager, when I was employee, I met white men in the workshop, working for the airline. As I arrived there, I told them, I don't need any white man in the workshop. All what they can do, I can do better than them. And the management agreed with me and sent them out of the workshop. They returned back to their country. I took over, I took over the workshop. Moving fine with the workshop, no problem, nothing, nothing. You know, they used to operate hatch operation and others. I was the person in charge of all everything in the workshop with my staff working under me. Hmm. Later on, we are moving fine. At the long run, I don't know what is happening. Around last year, September 17, just a sudden, I was called and give a sack letter. It was shock to me. Hmm. I don't know what happened. What have I done? I don't know. I asked the HR, please let him help me. I want to know something. What have I done? He, said he doesn't know anything. I bow down on his office and I appreciate God for what he has done. Mm. I just came out immediately. My spirit told me I bought me a malt and share to all the junior staff and I appreciate God. I left home. I went to my office also, where my section is. I share all what I'm supposed to share to them. I appreciate God. I share much for them. I finished. Now, I came back. I collected my letter on the 17th of September last year. That was when my job ended in the work office. I came back home and I explained to my prophetess. We prayed over it. That same night, in my dream, I just saw Papa arrive. When Papa arrived, I look at him, I told my prophetess, I said, look at Papa. She turned around and looked at him. Papa just turned to the right side. I saw a big building, shining inside, bright, very bright. Power. He followed that right side to the inside the building. And she too, she followed him. And I was holding a cake, a fine cake. As I was holding the cake, the cake fell down. I tried to pick the cake. It fell down the second time. And it, there is sand on it. I tried to clean the sand the third time and carry it. The, the third time it fell down. When it fell down, I left the cake there. I didn't consider with, um, concentrate with the cake again. I followed them. As Papa entered inside that bright building, my prophetess, my mama, she also followed him and enter. In reaching there, I stepped my leg to enter. I wake up. As I wake up... It was a dream. Yes, it was a dream. I now met my mama. I told her, this is the dream I passed through. Now, pray with me. She said, we must have to go to Maryland to see Papa. And we came last year on the surrounding water. Immediately, I go and register my partner. And this is my partner card with me. So when I register, during the one-on-one -on -one prayers, Papa pray with me and he touched my document which they gave to me as service no longer required. 
and he pray for me say go and come back with testimony mm. if you are clapping to celebrate this god you can do better than that yes our brother continue with your testimony we went back home within a short time i just uh called one of the directors in one airline he told me he had what happened with me i said yes he said what have i done i said i did, I did nothing he said snap the letter which they gave to you and sent to me i snapped it and sent it to him through whatsapp he got through nothing nothing no any excuse that qualified them to sack me just like that he now asked me to come on friday Friday, I reached there with my document. He go through them. He said, I should come on Monday. I just wait. Immediately Monday, I went back. After he, then I was interviewed on Friday, on Monday, I went back. We would just discuss in our discussion. At the end, he just brought an appointment letter of workshop manager, the same position. Praise the Lord. Can you start on your feet and celebrate this great grace for real? Celebrate his grace for real. This is wonderful. Right on the board, we can see some documents there. Sir, can you throw more light on them for a clearer understanding? One is the one for the appointment given to me first in the former place I work, which is Max Air in Kano, mm. as a workshop manager. And the second one was the termination at payment in the office in max air the third one that is the letter of the great appointment given unto me as the workshop manager in asman air now which i'm working now can you put your hands together for jesus christ for that we celebrate with you yes close to the document we can see some chairs there can you tell us more about those chairs he advised me to buy the chairs. chairs to come and appreciate God. Appreciate God, God yes. for what God has done for yes. you. For re your appointment. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. Amen. Now, for this turnaround breakthrough and the reinstatement of your appointment back to you, what do you have to tell the people of God? What advice do you have to give to people all over the world for what this God or Papa J have done in your life? Yes. Yes. Once again, I want to thank God for what he has done into my life. And also, I want to tell the whole world, any disappointment mm. is a blessing by who that believe, believe. So, I want to thank God for what he has done unto me. Everybody that has first a disappointment like uh, disappointment like this should go into God, run into mercy land, and pray unto God. God will solve your problem. Amen. In Jesus name. Amen. If you believe that, can you give the Lord a shout? Voilà, nous bénissons l'Éternel pour la vie de ces messieurs dont vous voyez à l'écran. Il a perdu son travail dans son lieu de travail. Et ceci fait en sorte que la dame dont vous voyez à l'écran, qui est son, sa prophétesse, elle lui avait demandé de venir ici à Christ Messiland pour assister à la prière. Et le prophète Jérémie a prié pour lui. Dès son retour, on l'a encore rappelé avec un nouveau boulot. Et c'est pourquoi il est revenu ici pour remercier le Dieu du prophète Jérémie. Applaudissons pour le Seigneur. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank, Thank you, Jesus. Jesus. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. Testimonies they continue in the house. You can see to your exalted thrones. Viewers all over the world, I, the prophet Jeremiah Mutufufuy, the one that will talk to the weather, weather understand. The one that talk to the, the cloud, the cloud understand. Prepare yourself, prepare your family. It will be explosive. I will increase the grace. More than this day. This one, I will now hide the grace so that when you now come, I don't want any complaint. Say, I have attended the program and there is no answer. No! Come, 
who are thou that disturbing you who are thou that block you now pastors get ready you need this hand to touch you businessmen business women come over hey as i am not poor when i touch you with my hand you shall never ever pour 